Hello everybody, I'm gonna present you tonight the power inverter folks, the power inverter here you go, oh my god, it's dazzling this is the real power inverter, AC inverter for the price of 10 bucks maybe, plus or minus this device is gonna be suitable for 110 volts or 220 or 240 volts depending where you're living the only thing you have to change is the transformer all right folks so you see here a bunch of wires and stuff let me turn it down a little bit Whew. yes got the real power friends can you see it very dazzling so we're gonna get started i'm gonna show you exactly how to do it and at some point in the video is gonna be a diagram but it's not much a diagram because this is too easy everybody can do it but comes with a price in the 10 bucks kind of price you know you have to buy uh, a small device from ebay and the transformer if you don't have it you know so that's the cost in the rest just a bunch of wires and everybody believe me everybody can do it all right folks so let's get started we are back <clears throat> and i'm gonna tell you first thing you know to make this power inverter and any kind of inverters actually the most important part is the oscillator yeah the oscillator is the most important part after that Came the transformer and some transistors but the oscillator is the most important part so I did manage to find this one on Amazon but I can I think is on eBay as well and on other websites this very tiny circuit which is name is YL 107 but is a clock oscillator or a pulse generator I'm gonna put the link where I did boy bought it from Amazon and as well the description and uh, all stuff. So what do you have to know about this one? This has a regular pin here. Got some adjustments I tried to adjust it, but without an oscilloscope I cannot see exactly the, the, the frequency and amplitude and all the stuff. But for you. To understand it it's got three pins here you can see three pins the first one is vcc ground and out and a jumper that connects to the four connection i did put mine on a second connection and with this i did manage to find a, a cable like this one is from an old uh, dvd i'm guessing or something like that and fits inside here perfectly here you go. and I got the three connection here I choose to power this uh, oscillator with a small power bank but this one has a very various range so you can power this one with the 4 volts 5 6 9 and 12 don't worry about it all right so the main thing is we got the oscillator we're gonna need as well a transistor i did use the old trusty 2n3055 npn transistor like so but you can use a mosfet you can use uh, various type of things so we got the oscillator we got the transistor we're gonna power the oscillator with the power bank we got the transformer that uh, we didn't manage to salvage from a 12 volts car battery charger that you can find it here in the description somewhere this is a straightforward transformer it's got um, this is the output and this is the input so this is the primary and this is the secondary no center tap no nothing and for the load 
we have these various bulbs you can see this one is 243 watts you can see it's got the stuff inside we didn't uh, open it up no as well this is a 3 watts and so on i tested till 10 watts it dries very well you saw the powerful light yeah so but the rest is just poetry <laughs> all right friends so stay tuned we're gonna bring in some paper clips and some uh, alligator clips and we're gonna mount it all right all right friends i do have here the connector with two three cables the two of them which is vcc and ground have them connected to a usb so we're gonna plug in just like so this stuff and very careful to not touch the wires and to make it sure because it's a very delicate thing all right we're gonna bring in the the power bank to see if we got the connection right let's see as you can see here is a small tiny light yeah so the oscillator is working after that we're gonna put this one aside we're gonna bring in the transistor the old trusty one you should know by now base emitter and all the chassis is the collector so the third pin which is out we're gonna connect it to the base of the transistor just like so base emitter from the emitter we're gonna jump a cable all right so from the emitter the alligator clip is gonna go to the middle point of the oscillator which is ground We get that part the same from the emitter we're gonna connect another alligator clip that is gonna connect to our battery in this case is a 18 volts battery so we're gonna put this one to battery aside so we got left the collector and that's about it all right then okay now we're gonna bring in the transformer this is the primary this is the secondary so we're gonna put this one here we're gonna connect the you think yeah so the collector or the transistor is gonna do is gonna go to one of the primary pins doesn't matter which one because it's alternating sorry so it doesn't matter and the other lead of the transistor uh, so, uh, sorry the um, transformer is gonna connect to the positive of the battery and those wire here we're gonna connect the load doesn't matter again which one is which because it's alternating current so this one is an alternating inverter or AC inverter so it's gonna connect like so and we're gonna hope for the best now let's double check the wires all right folks we did manage to check again all the wires let me give you a close-up to 
see all the components. It's very messy, but believe me, it does the trick. And now let's put it to battery. And fingers crossed. Woohoo, friends, we got light. We got light and it's not tiny. Nope, it's not. Let me put it again. Be very careful. Do not touch all this wire because it's still AC and <laughs> here we go friends. Here we go. We got power. Very easy to make. Very cheap. For the price of 10 bucks you can make this uh, AC power inverter. Anyone can do it from all over the world. So more easier than this I don't think is possible. Alright friends, stay tuned. Put a comment below, subscribe and share the fun if you like it. If not, that's the way it is. It's always a next time. Till then, take care and all the best. Woohoo! Yeah! Here you go. No skills required. Power inverter. Yeah!